Welcome back. The privacy of patients at Lexington Medical Center could be at risk after a data breach last fall. Now, in a letter sent to patients, the hospital is admitting their personal information may have been exposed to hackers. Our Sam Shapiro shares tips that people can use to protect yourselves against data thieves. This started back in October when an LMC spokesperson says an unauthorized party accessed the email account of one hospital employee and after further investigation, a number of files in the employee's email account and data drive contain billing related documents and patients personal information, including social security numbers. LMC says its investigation was unable to determine with any certainty that hackers accessed these files. I spoke to a patient currently receiving treatment at Lexington Medical who says she's been getting weird phone calls. She said now she's been checking her credit reports more frequently. My medical records are on there, so of course, my social security, all my personal information, where I had previous surgeries, where I had my babies at, all that is in my chart. So of course, if they're going to take data from my financial side, of course, they might take data from my health side too. She is one of nearly 2,000 LMC patients who were notified of the data breach. I spoke with Kimiko Myers, the owner of Team Logic IT, who told me some tips people can use to protect themselves from data breaches like the one at LMC. He says there are two major things to do when finding out your social security number and other data has been leaked. First, he says people should monitor their credit reports more closely to make sure nobody else is using your information. He also mentioned people who know their data was leaked should also consider putting a credit freeze on your account. So what happens in that process is that you'll create a PIN. Um, you know, of course, they'll identify you to make sure that you are who you say you are. Um, a PIN will be created. And then going forward, you know, if, if there's any attempt to, you know, for example, open credit in your name, maybe a mortgage or what have you, uh, that won't be able to be done. According to Lexington Medical, the patients whose social security numbers were in the compromised files were offered free credit monitoring. Reporting in the newsroom, Sam Shapiro, WIS News 10.